In this video, I'm gonna show you how to play Dandelions by Ruth B. If you like the video, please like and subscribe. Leave me a comment down below. Also, check out the Patreon. For as little as $5 a month, you can get access to all these lessons. And for this one, you're gonna get a guitar pro file for the lesson, as well as a PDF. Grab a guitar and let's play. Dandelions by Ruth B is a perfect song for any beginners to play. You're just going to need a capo that we're going to use on the 6th fret and just four open position chords. So let's go through those chords right now. For these chords, I'm going to reference all the chord shapes as they relate to the capo on the 6th fret. It may not be obvious when first listening to the song, but it's actually in 12-8. So each chord that we strum is going to get six beats. So it's going to start off with C, and then E minor, G, and then D. And it's gonna repeat these chords over and over again the entire song. And you could count it like this. One, two, three, four, five, six, one, two, three, four, five, six, one, two, three, four, five, six, one, three, four, five, six, one, two, 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 three, four, five, six. And then during the song, if you wanted to get a little more strummy with it. So now that we have the chords, let's actually take a look at that little keyboard melody that kicks off the song. So the keyboard pattern in the very beginning is four measures long, and it's gonna start off with an open first string, third fret on the second string, two opens on the second string, second fret on the third string, back to open second, back to second on the third string, and then third string open. We'll go on to the second measure, which is very similar. It's going to start the same way. Open, three, open, open, two, open, and then it's going to go two on the third fret, uh, third string, open second string, back to two on the third string. So those two parts together will sound like this. Third measure, it's kind of a slightly different part. We're gonna start down on the fourth string, second fret, third string open, third string second, open second, back to third string second, third string open, and then second string open. Finally, the last measure, gonna be similar to the previous measure, only it's gonna start with an open four, two on the fourth string, open third, open second, second fret third string, open third, and then second fret third string again. So those last two measures will sound like this. All together, four measures. Even though musically it's a pretty straightforward song, it's a really fun song to play. But thanks for watching. If you liked the video, please like and subscribe down below and consider checking out the Patreon. For as little as five bucks a month, you can get access to the Guitar Pro file for this lesson as well as the PDF uh, and, and all of all the other lessons I have there too. So leave me a comment, like and subscribe, and let me know what you think down in the comments. Thanks, and we'll see you in the next video.